Hello guys, it's unit 3, part F. Today we are going to see diagnosis of pregnancy. This diagnosis of pregnancy is actually based on trimester. This trimester is actually divided into three types and each three part has its own subjective and objective data. Well, first trimester is nothing but from the conception till the 12th week from the conception till the 12th week that is considered as first trimester that is nothing but first three months and here subject to data that is nothing but what does patient say and this is object to data that is nothing but what that science says at the from the conception till the three months at this period women has few complaints those are amenuria morning sickness frequency of maturation Breast discomfort. Amenuria is nothing but absence of menstruation. Women will not get her menstruation. Morning sickness. Morning sickness is nothing but she feels nausea and vomiting at the early in the morning, at the empty stomach. That is morning sickness. It is due to the increase of hormones. Frequency of maturation. Frequency of maturation is nothing but frequency of urination. Next, breast discomfort. Breast discomfort is due to the enlargement of the breast. These are the complaints where female says generally from conception to the 12th week. That is in 3 months, these are the complaints where the pregnant woman sees. Objective data. What the sign says. First, breast changes. In breast changes, we can see breast enlargement. Breast generally becomes bigger in size. That gets enlarged. And there is a pigment of areola. Areola get pigmented. Around areola, around areola, the dark color becomes darker. Yellow secretion. Yellow secretion is seen because of accumulation of cholesterol. Next, there are changes in pelvic. In pelvic, the first change is nothing but Jacquemart sign or Chadwick sign. Around vagina, you can see there is a dusky color or bit uh, brownish color discoloration is seen. And that sign and symptom is called as Jacuma sign or Chadwick sign. Vaginal sign is nothing but vagina becomes softer. And this sign is seen around the 6th week. From the pregnancy, around 6th week, you can see the vagina becomes much softer than the before. Next, Ascender sign. Ascender signs is nothing but you can see pulsation. You can hear a beat around vagina. In vaginal wall, you can hear a beat. You can see a pulsation and that is nothing but Ascender sign. Next, cervical sign or Goodell sign. This is nothing but softening of cervix and this is also seen around 6th week. Next, Uterine sign. Uterine signs are nothing but there is an increase in size, softening and elastic. The uterus which carries the baby that keeps on increasing its size month after month and it becomes softer and even it is elastic. It is elastic and because of that feature, this uterus is being expanded every month. Next, Hegel sign. And this is softening of a region that is between the cervix and the uterus. Between the cervix and the uterus, there is a region, there is a connection and that part becomes softer and that is nothing but Hegel sign. In pelvic, we can see Jacumer sign or Chadwick sign that is nothing but discoloration around the vagina, vaginal sign, softening of the vagina, Ossender sign, there is a pulsation around the vagina, cervix sign or Goodell sign, softening of the cervix, uterine sign, that is increase of the uterus and elasticity and softening of the uterus. Hegel sign. This is nothing but the softening of the region between the uterus and the cervix. These are the signs that are seen in the pelvic. Questions will be provided at the end of the chapter. Until then stay tuned. Meet you in the next video.